Okay, so. I'll hand in the Titan Slayer. There's a lot to talk about here. Some people do different things for a hand in, so I'm just going to talk about the way I do it because I don't know how people do it the other ways. I do the fight entirely with the D-pad. Um, I think it's easier. It sets you up so you know exactly how the fight's going to go down every single time. There's no kind of ambiguity with it. So you're going to come up, and I go right here, middle of this black diamond on the floor, on the one line. And you could take a direct uh, D-pad shot at that arrow. It's up and left diagonal and you'll always hit that arrow to start the fight as soon as the fight starts you, as soon as it starts you gotta start moving I roll down here to this right wall and if you see this little square on the ground right here this is where I'm going to stand and I will stand in this spot until Titan Slayer hits the ground he's going to kind of come to the middle of the arena hit the ground and start charging his arrow as soon as he hits the ground you're going to hold left on the D-pad, roll, and you're going to hold X to run. You're just going to keep hold, or A, or whatever you're using. You're going to hold run. So the fight starts. You're going to come over to the square. He's going to hit the ground, and you're going to start running. Running, 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 running. Don't stop running. He's going to shoot the arrow, and it's going to come down this way, bounce off this wall, and come back up. It's always going to miss you. But the nice thing about this is is you're running across the room, it's gonna miss you, and the air is gonna pass right in front of you. So you can keep holding left, and just aim and shoot directly left. So it's, the whole fight is basically left inputs. So you're gonna run left until the arrow passes you, and then it's gonna bounce off the wall down here, and pass right in front of you, so you can just shoot left. As soon as you've hit that arrow, he's gonna become weak. You can just diagonal right roll, and shoot and you should kill him. Sometimes you may have to pick up the uh, analog stick to kind of alter this roll a bit, but it, it this is the easy part. Hitting the arrow is the part that's difficult. So I'm gonna show that in full motion. Uh, it's pretty simple. It's really, once you get the hang of it, it's I think it's a really nice strap because it's very consistent with the D-pad. So we're gonna start the fight with the diagonal shot. And we're going to run, 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 run to that right wall. To the square hits the ground we run left we're gonna hold left miss shoot directly left roll and kill the knight just like that so that's the way I do knight I think it's very nice it's consistent and that's pretty much all I have to say about that so next I guess I'll talk about avarice it's pretty standard but 